pick they are looking for to stay awake. They can also be your ticket to the races at Pocono later this month. Newswatch 16th is later this month, next month. It's coming up. Yeah. Newswatch 16th, John Hickey explains in this week's Power to Save. For the third year in a row, Pocono Raceway is taking part in the Monster Energy NASCAR Free Friday. Monster and NASCAR approached us and said, hey, look, we've been doing this forever at Supercross. We've recycled a million cans. You get free entry. Um, and we said, we're in. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. You can recycle any size, any can, as long as it has that claw logo on it. The process is easy. Park your car, which is free. Uh, walk up to our gates. We'll have a huge setup with Monster Energy, with NASCAR Green, uh, our Pocono Raceway Street team. Maybe Tricky the Fox will be there. Uh, simple as this. Drop a can. Walk through the gate. The Heighton Area School District teacher Guy Potts heard about this free Friday last year and wanted his students to get involved. For us to get in the fanfare, we needed to bring one can per student. And so I wanted to make sure that we did a little bit better than that. And we brought up almost 200 cans last year. Everyone that brings an empty can of Monster Energy to Pocono Raceway on May 31st gets free admission to the fanfare area, an autograph session, practice for the Xfinity and Cup Series races. In addition to seeing the stars of NASCAR on track, the future stars of NASCAR, you also get to see uh, an actual race with the ARCA Series. Kids are excited about recycling. They might not say it, but if they can do it and be a part of something like we were last year at Fanfare, uh, they had a great time. That excitement and turnout from just one school district last year has at least four other districts involved this year, with 7,500 cans recycled through the first two years of the program and more school districts involved this year, Pocono Raceway officials tell us. Maybe we can double it this year. <laughs> with this week's Power to Save, John Hickey, Newswatch 16, Monroe County. And it was sunny skies.